Tanya, yes, they were eager, they were determined, and they all told me they saw no other choice. In Covington's Convention Center, Kentucky's primary, postponed by the coronavirus pandemic, reeled in people determined to see their ballot scanned. I just think it's awesome. Jesse Robinson brought his daughter, Roslyn, to show her how to exercise her right to vote. Uh, I chose to bring her because I'd like to show her, show her anything I possibly can, and I don't necessarily trust mail-in ballots. I don't know where they're going, who's getting them, um, so I decided to walk in and do it myself. I mean, it's just got to be done, you know? I'm not going to let anything stop me from voting, you know what I mean? We took a long time, <laughs> took a long time for us to get here to vote, so, you know, my ancestors and so on and so forth, so, you know, it's a real pleasure to be here to vote. In Campbell County, their record for total primary votes is 13,700. Before polls opened, the clerk counted 20,000 mail votes alone. Boone County saw record mailed ballots in two weeks of solid early voting turnout. Scott and Elizabeth Mosea could not do it. Though forced to drive 20 minutes to vote in Covington, Scott showed up wearing red, white, and blue. I have swim trunks that match it, so it just uh, happens to be a patriotic shirt I thought was appropriate to wear to vote. It's the way I've I've always done it and, you know, I feel there could be less corruption, you know, coming down voting on the day you're supposed to as opposed to early voting and mail in. Clerks reported no problems and close to no confusion. They credit weeks of advertising and the surge of voting that came in the mail. County clerks should have those in-person tallies pretty quickly the mail-in vote totals that's going to take days those postmarked today and those dropped off by six o'clock tonight and those that arrive by saturday those will all be counted now i will tell you all the county clerks that we talked with today they were holding their breath before today's process played itself out coming up at six we'll see what kind of problems if any they encountered back to you